Hi, welcome to today's workout. I'm Coach Anj and I'm here to guide you through a full body, body weight only workout. No equipment needed, just prepare a small bottle of water and a towel. And if you're ready, let's begin with the warm up. Today's workout will start with a couple of exercises for the warm up. We'll have 30 seconds each and two rounds of that, no breaks in between, okay? Just to warm up the whole body, starting with the head circles in three, two, one, let's go. We'll do one side 15 seconds and then switch direction. Relax those arms. And switch. Look all the way up and then all the way down. Go on. Five, four, three, two, one. We'll get fu full arm rotations forward. For 30 seconds, keep breathing. Let's get those arms warmed up. Keep that tummy in, back straight, chest up, breathe. And five, four, three, two, and one. Backwards. Continue the same. That's it. Go on. Big circles. Keep going. Few more. And five, four, three, two, one. We'll do an interesting hip openings, front and back. Going twice down, twice push the hips forward, lean back, okay? Let's go together. Three, two, one, come on. Forward and back, twice and twice. Open up the stance, a little bit wider than your shoulders. Twice, back. and five four three two and one place those feet together we'll make a small step forward and go twice on that leg go with me keep that front leg straight you can go backwards as well and again forward keep the forward leg front leg straight go one and five, four, three, two, and one. Wide jacks is the last one. We'll go out and in together, upper and lower body. Let's go. Similar to the jumping jacks. Open up the chest. Breathe. Almost done. And five, four, three, two, and one. Good. Ready for the round two? Let's start with the head circles again. Only one side first. Breathe. Get your heart rate down. Let's switch. Last five, four, three, two, and one. Full arm rotations again. Only forward. Are you getting warmed up? I am. <laughs> Keep it up. Speed up the pace if you're not warmed up yet. And switch backwards. A few seconds left. Five. 
five, four, three, two, one. Remember the hip openings, let's go. Twice and twice, push, push. So try to maintain 90 degrees or halfway on the way down with the upper body. No need to go lower. Just push the hips forward and back. Last five, four, three, two, and one. And go again with the hamstring stretch. Let's start half a step and go on that front leg. That's it, keep it up. Try not to hunch the back down, keep the chest up, back is straight. Okay, five, four, three, two, and one. And are you ready for the Y jacks? Let's go. Last round, push, push, push. You should be warmed up already and ready for the main workout soon. Keep it up a bit more. And five, four, three, two, and one. Well done for the warm up. All right, I hope you got warmed up and you're ready for the main workout. We'll have a couple of exercises, 30 seconds on, 30 seconds off. Two rounds of that and one minute break between the rounds. The very first one I'll quickly show you is the walkouts from the starting position, going down into the plank and walking back up. You can slightly bend your knees if, if needed, okay? Let's start together in three, two, one, let's go. Pause down for a second, squeeze that core and push yourself back up. Keep breathing, keep going. And five, four, three, two and one. Good. Shake your body off. <laughs> quickly rest 30 seconds and I'll show you the next one while you're resting okay we'll have side kick side kick down into the jump squat okay and side kick side kick jump squat okay we'll start with that in a few seconds you ready in five four three two and one let's go kick kick and jump up Good, come on. That's it, come on. Bring that leg up. Nice, let's go. That's a combat workout, isn't it? Come on. And last five, four, three, two, and one. 30 seconds break. Well done with this. Breathe. While you're resting, I'll quickly show you the next one. We'll remain in the standing position, both hands behind the head, and then bring the knee up on the side and crunch on that knee, okay? Squeeze in the core. Rest a little longer. You ready? In five, four, three, two, and one. Let's go. Exhale each time when you bring that knee up. Squeeze your tummy, all right? Let it work, both sides. There you go. A few seconds left, come on. And five, four, three, two, and one. Well done, 30 seconds rest. That was a good one. We'll have another exercise. I'll quickly demonstrate you. Curtsy lunges, 
right side only, having the right leg forward, going with the left behind and diagonal and bringing it back. There we go. Only one side working, rest, and then we switch the sides. We'll go in five, four, three, two, and one. Let's go. Have the chest high up, coming in. Go on. Do it at your pace, but don't make break when there's no break time. <laughs> Come on. And five, four, three, two, and one. Good, 30 seconds rest. Shake it off, shake it off. We'll perform the same thing on the left side, okay? Rest a little longer. Feeling good? Let's get ready. And go in five, four, three, two, and one. Let's start. Good, all the way down. Don't cut the move. You should put more pressure on the front leg, okay? Feel the glutes, feel the side of your leg working. And five, four, three, two, and one. Good, get some rest, 30 seconds again. The next one will be on the ground, tabletop, from this position, bent legs, we're gonna push the hips up, look up and bring it down. Tap the ground and again, up and down, okay? Hands behind and next to your body. You ready? In five, four, three, two and one. Let's go. Breathe, tap down. Push as high as you can, squeeze in the glutes you'll be able to push even higher. Breathe. And five, four, keep going. Three, two, and one. Well done, get some rest, 30 seconds. Woo, this one seems so simple, right? but you can feel your full body working. The next one, similar position, spider. We stay high up with the hips a little higher and then opposite leg and opposite hand. Okay, tap that foot, tap, tap. You ready? Let's go together. Five, four, three, two, and one. Come on. Hold that balance. So you have to put the pressure always on the opposite sides. Don't have it only on the one arm or one leg, okay? Keep it up, a few more. Whoo, feeling those arms? And five, four, three, two, and one. Well done, shake it off, shake it off. Have a quick sip of water. I'll show you the next one. Lying on the ground, legs stay in the same position. We'll have the um, pelvis down, okay? Back straight, squeezing it on top when you push the hips up. Squeeze the glutes, okay? Let's go in five, four, three, two, and one. Come on. So don't arch your back. Just a small move from your hips, squeeze, okay? I usually lift my head up, but if you feel too much pressure in your neck, you can hold the head or leave it down on the ground. As long as you feel your muscles on the glutes working. Keep it up. And five, four, three, two, and one. Well done, you can shake it off and slowly stand up. We have a little break again. And then the last exercise, your favorite, I know. 
burpees, okay? Small hop up, we'll go into the half burpee, which is the plank position, and back up, okay? Let's smash this one, come on. Rest a little longer, get ready. Ready, ready, five, four, three, two, and one. Let's go, up and down into a quick plank position. Push, 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 push. Give me that high jump up. <laughs> and five, four, give me a few more. Three, two, and one. Woo! Well done, we have one minute break. Woo that was a good one. <laughs> Or a bad one you can hear my voice right <sighs> breathe shake your arms off relax we'll have one more round another 30 seconds rest have a little sip of water <sighs> we'll have one more round and then an easy cool down. Basically halfway through, not that bad. Another 15 seconds. The first exercise is the walkouts. Stand in position, down. Okay, let's go in five, four, three. You continue with me and one, let's go. Pause down for a second, squeeze that core and push yourself back up. Keep breathing, keep going. And five, four, three, two, and one. Good. Shake your body off <laughs> quickly. Rest 30 seconds and I'll show you the next one while you're resting, okay? We'll have side kick side kick down into the jump squat okay and side kick side kick jump squat okay we'll start with that in a few seconds you ready in five four three two and one let's go kick kick and jump up good come on that's it come on Bring that leg up. <laughs> nice, let's go. That's a combat workout, isn't it? <laughs> Come on. And last five, four, three, two, and one. 30 seconds break. Well done with this. <sighs> Breathe. While you're resting, I'll quickly show you the next one. We'll remain in the standing position, both hands behind the head and then bring the knee up on the side and crunch on that knee, okay? Squeeze in the core. Rest a little longer. You ready? In five, four, three, two, and one. Let's go. Exhale each time when you bring that knee up. Squeeze your tummy, all right? Let it work, both sides. There we go. A few seconds left, come on. And five, four, three, two, and one. Well done, 30 seconds rest. <sighs> that was a good one. We'll have another exercise. I'll quickly demonstrate you. Curtsy lunges, right side only, having the right leg forward, going with the left behind and diagonal and bringing it back. There we go. Only one side working, rest, and then we switch the sides. We'll go in five, four, three, two, and one. Let's go. Have the chest high up, tummy in, go on.
Do it at your pace, but don't make break when there's no break time. <laughs> Come on. And five, four, three, two, and one. Good, 30 seconds rest. Shake it off, shake it off. We'll perform the same thing on the left side, okay? Rest a little longer. Feeling good? Let's get ready. And go in five, four, three, two, and one. Let's start. Good, all the way down. Don't cut the move. You should put more pressure on the front leg, okay? Feel the glutes, feel the side of your leg working. And five, four, three, two, and one. Good, get some rest, 30 seconds again. The next one will be on the ground, tabletop, from this position, bent legs, we're gonna push the hips up, look up and bring it down. Tap the ground and again, up and down, okay? Hands behind and next to your body. You ready? In five, four, three, two and one. Let's go. Breathe, tap down. Push as high as you can, squeeze in the glutes you'll be able to push even higher. Breathe. And five, four, keep going. Three, two, and one. Well done, get some rest, 30 seconds. Woo, this one seems so simple, right? but you can feel your full body working. The next one, similar position, spider. We stay high up with the hips a little higher and then opposite leg and opposite hand. Okay, tap that foot, tap, tap. You ready? Let's go together. Five, four, three, two, and one. Come on. Hold that balance. So you have to put the pressure always on the opposite sides. Don't have it only on the one arm or one leg, okay? Keep it up, a few more. Whoo, feeling those arms? And five, four, three, two, and one. Well done, shake it off, shake it off. Have a quick sip of water. I'll show you the next one. Lying on the ground, legs stay in the same position. We'll have the um, pelvis down, okay? Back straight, squeezing it on top when you push the hips up. Squeeze the glutes, okay? Let's go in five, four, three, two, and one. Come on. So don't arch your back. Just a small move from your hips, squeeze, okay? I usually lift my head up, but if you feel too much pressure in your neck, you can hold the head or leave it down on the ground. As long as you feel your muscles on the glutes working. Keep it up. And five, four, three, two, and one. Well done, you can shake it off and slowly stand up. We have a little break again. And then the last exercise, your favorite, I know, burpees, okay? Small hop up, we'll go into the half burpee, which is the plank position, and back up, okay? Let's smash this one, come on. Rest a little longer, get ready. Ready, ready, five, four, three, two, and one. Let's go, up. And down into a quick plank position. Push, 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 push. Give me that high jump up. <laughs> oh.
All right, and five, four, three, two, and one. Well done, we are done with the round two. Well done for today. The only thing that's left is the cool down. Okay, the only thing that's left is the cool down. We can go down on our knees, open it up a bit, sit down and go into the child pose. Let's hold here for 30 seconds. Breathe, get your heart rate down. I'll let you know when we have last five seconds. There will be a couple of exercises and we are done for today. And last five, four, three, two, and one. We we'll go slowly back, all the way back, staying in the same position, pushing the hips up and stretching those quads. Let's hold here for another 30 seconds. You can squeeze the glutes a little bit in order to push your hips even higher. And five, four, three, two, and one. Going back forward into the cobra position. 30 seconds here. Bring those hips low as you can. Shoulders back, head looking all the way up. Breathe. And five, four, three, two, and one. We can sit down into the butterfly position, feet together, knees wide out, and slowly bounce. Keep that nice posture the whole time. Chest up, back is straight. We can push one side, relax those arms. And five, four, three, two, and one. Good. Let's have one side bend. Hold another up leg. We're stretching out the hamstrings. And we switch in five, four, three, two, and one. Right leg bent, hold the left toes. Try to keep the chest out, back straight, don't hunch down. Nice posture always. And five, four, three, two, and one. Turn around from the plank position. We're gonna have push the hips up and then release one leg, put it behind the other and just stretch the calves. Stay there. Try to bring the uh, heel down so you feel them more. Just stretch in your calf. Let's switch in five, four, three, two, and one. Place another leg down. The other one is behind the leg. We're almost done with today's workout. And five, four, three, two, and one. Let's go slowly back up. Shake those legs and arms. We'll have the last two side arm stretch. Bring the right one towards your chest. Push it with the left arm and feel a nice stretch in your right arm. Last 
Let's switch in five, four, three, two, and one. Hold the left arm. Last 30 seconds. And five, four, three, two, and one. Well done for today. We are officially done. Well done for today. I know you gave your best. Don't forget to stay hydrated and get enough for rest. And I hope to see you very soon again. Until then, bye-bye.